Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a fantastic day, whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening. I'm glad you're here. What we're going to attempt to do today, guys, on camera is switch out our Kunwoo Axis Springs for the Kunwoo Strong Springs. Um, this also came with an extra set of regular Kunwoo Springs. And when I was checking these out, these are definitely going to be a stronger, a stronger spring. So what we're going to do is, let's see, get the body screws first. Clip is going to be T6. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. All right, I'm just gonna do it like that. Guys, this is the little kind of things that drive me just crazy. All right. I apologize for the, all right, oh, that barrel's going to fall through, so that's the barrel. Interesting. That's the front barrel, which is right there. Let's see, that one must be a barrel too. All right, go to our T8. Using combat beads, G10 driver that I picked up from Lefty EDC. Hmm, I wonder if I have to take that button off. That scale would go right over that button. Come on guys, I'm getting a little wiggly wiggly here. I'm about to go get one of my little, let me grab a little prop. Back and came out. Got my back spacer flopping. Well, let's just do this just for S and G's. It does have a Torx on it. Maybe that does come out. Or maybe I'll make it where I can't put it back together. All right. Okay, so that was holding it in place. So, backspacer. Because we're going to do this different. We're going to go at this one side at a time. I think that is our plan. So, when I look at the way these springs are... Okay, this is this spring. Hmm. 
Whoops. I'm gonna take the whole assembly off. I'll take that spring out. Hopefully you guys are getting that. The spring up here. Get the spring right here. Guys, that was um, too easy. Makes me nervous. We're gonna see what happens. Let me go back the other way. Put it back in there, just holding everything together. Put a little funky madoodle finger slaughter back in here. These screws, the hardware is really, really nice. I don't know if y'all can see that. I'll show you on some of the body screws. Get that screw started, which I did. Just like tweak back down there. Noise. So then pop our barrel back up this way. Do our backspacer. See those body screws, how well they're done, how well they're machined. Let's go in here. And let's screw that down. Loose enough to get our backspacer lined up. There we go. And I'm not gonna tighten all these down yet. Cause I'm gonna go on this other side. I'm gonna try to get our other axis spring without having to get into That's not gonna work. All right, plan B. I'm gonna have to take that pivot out one way or another. So, I might as well just take the whole thing apart. Like I had it. And then keep going. <sighs> This stuff together.
V-shaped pivot. That wasn't good. Well, that was an axis spring jettison across the room, guys. So I'm going to have to pause it here. We're back, guys. That's my first edit. But I did find my jettison spring and spring part. So that was pretty sketch. So let's see what we can do now. Pivot, our stop pin. Our bearings. So we've got a lock in here. I'm going to take my pivot out across the way. G shaped. I'm going to take this out and try not to jettison this spring. Guys, hold on two seconds. Sorry about that. I had to go get my little knip axe to try to get this bad boy unscrewed. Put this spring on there, and then let's see. this Hmm. 
See how that's gonna roll. is going to do that. That is This is a fucking whack spring, guys, but I have a feeling that this is going to have to be how it works. I'm going to have to hold it, get it sandwiched in there. Like so. Yes, yes, yes. Once I figured out what I was doing, I don't think it's going to be too hard to say that. I probably just jinxed myself. Let's get this not mad taken care of. Let's go do it all like that. That's where the captive is, which means this is probably backwards too. No, this is actually in the right way because we didn't take it apart. captured in here without shooting it across the room guys it's amazing that i found that spring in this assembly i mean no short of amazing I guess it would help if I was on camera. I'm just 
is sitting over here stressing the shark. Let's see if that's in place. No. I don't think about it. Yes, it is in place. That is in place. It is in place. All right. So now, we'll try to put this other screw, which is going to have nothing to screw into. All right, so that's not going to help us much, except maybe keeping that. All right, we just need to keep that together. No, didn't think that was going to last, did y'all? is going to be at the top. It's right where I've caught it. Guys, it's not even six o'clock in the morning yet, and I'm sitting here wrestling with a disassembly. You guys should be proud of me. That's why I'm not talking much. I ain't got much to say because I'm not much awake. All right, stop pins in. Let's see how to get this cluster fuck back together. Right, it's gonna be our ball pivot, so we want to do like this. release and we want to jam that bitch in there like that Space, huh? This is clunky funky, guys. again.
Guys, this is a proving a huge pain in the ass. And I'm sure I'm not doing something right because I've forgotten where I started. There we go. Now if I could just get this to seat into this. I got like three parts that gotta go in at once. I gotta get that through. There we go. That's the way we got to do it. Stupid John. Let's not jettison our. Let's not jettison our spring. Lock that in there. I can tell y'all what. These springs are much stiffer. Whether that's going to be a good thing if I can ever get them in, I'm sure it will. But can I get them in? All right. Now, herein lies another problem. Without tearing it apart, we've got to get our back spacer set. Awesome. Now we're going to blow this bitch through the back. Just get one of these lined up, we'd be off to a much better races. I just get one of these body screws to cooperate. To help me hold this heavy gunny gung gung. And I would warn you guys, this is not for the squeamish. If you haven't fully woken up, I would not take on this project. No, but it seems to lock together very nicely. Let's see what we got here. Oh, let's go with the body screw. Boom. it was a little stiff I'm not sure I wasn't gonna force it so I'm going to get this mounted in there first the bar lock kind of cinched in there Struggle bus. Be no fun without the struggle bus. These barrels can go through actually either way. They just gotta line up with our um, with our backspacer. Yeah. 
Okay, we're moving now. There we go. Bang. Bang. Much stiffer springs. Say that. Oh yeah. Putting my clip back on. I really dig this clip. I mean, Kung Wu's kind of turning it up on a lot of different areas, but I really like this tie clip that they've done. I think it's an improvement over the clips of the X towel and the Big towel. Whoops. Blade play, perfectly centered. Could loosen up just a hair. It'll loosen itself up. So guys, y'all got to watch me struggle bus through the Kunwu Pulsar Spring Swap. I have a feeling that I'm going to be very stoked that I switched those springs out. I can already tell it's got a little bit more resistance on that pop, um, which is a good thing. Uh, the construction of this knife is very well done, very easy to take it apart as long as you pay attention to what you're doing, unlike I did, and you don't do it between the hours of four and clock, four and five o'clock in the morning. But guys. I appreciate you watching this video and you will see an edit in the middle of this video if I'm able to fuse part one and part two together or you might not see a video. We will see. But that is the Kunwu Pulsar Stiffer Springs. Does it make a difference? Absolutely. Can I shake it out? No. See, I could shake it out before. I should have shown you guys that. But anyway, guys, I appreciate any amount of time you spend with me. I love having you guys visit me on the lives. I love having you watch my videos. I get stoked when you look out for the guy or gal to your left. Please look out for the guy or gal to your right. Look out for each other. Move forward with love in your heart. Always choose debate before hate. Until we meet again, peace.